to as like a leader first, and yes. pursuit and such as your career. What was that like, that moment for you? Uh, it was great. You know, it, it was fun to be able to you know score and, and, and celebrate my teammates with Salah and everything like that. Everybody hyping me up, slapping my helmet and everything. So it was great. Mm -hmm. How have you really think you improved over the past five weeks? Uh, you know, I improved a lot, but uh, it's always room for improvement. I can always get better in my game and you know, never be satisfied. How much more room does this defense have potential-wise? Uh, we got the, the ceiling's high. You know, we have great defense. We got a lot to work on, and we could be great. We could be one of the best defenses in that level. And playing on the road, too, how does it prepare you guys heading into next week? You said it one more time. Playing on the road, too, the game, that first road win out of the way, how does that prepare you guys for next week? Uh, you know, we just got to go in there, go into the game, you know, block the crowd out and just go out there and go play football. I apologize if you were asking. Can you just walk me through that pick six? What were you thinking? Did you think <laughs> just get the ball first and then somehow you spun to the end zone? Yeah, so uh, basically I was kind of in coverage, not considered coverage, and uh, kind of seeing that it was a screen, the ball got tipped, just put my hands out there, caught it. Honestly, I thought I was going to get tackled, but I was like, nah, like, I'm not going to get tackled. Kind of spun out and just ran straight for the end zone. I didn't really have to run it there, but it was, it was cool. Salem says it takes a lot of pressure off the offense when you guys can get into the end zone. Past Alabama teams have made a habit of getting into the end zone multiple times a game. Is that a mission that you set for yourself, trying to score a defensive touchdown? Yes, that's what we strive for. We strive on defense to create two goals and have it. You know, our, our goal is to get through a game and appreciate sure my game. Chris, so much. Chris, how does that help you guys when Coach Saban, like in the first half, he got pretty fire in a few moments. When when he it's vocal, animated, how does that help you guys get going? Oh, you know, it's great. That's one of the best things about Coach Saban, you know. And once we, you know, see how he was ranting on the sideline, we knew we had to step it up and just settle down and play our keys and read our keys and just go play Bama football. All right, thank you.